Congratulations, a much needed win. Did you get the performance to go with the result today? We have to win every game. So you can make me every game the same question. And we did today. Uh, sometimes you have to find a way to win. Um, first minutes of the game, uh, we had some problems. But after Andre uh, stopped the penalty and then the goal by Mata, Matthijs de Ligt, uh, I think the game was all ours. Marcus Rashford got his first goal for Manchester United since March in this game today. What can a goal like that do for a player like him? No, it's very important. We spoke about before the game. And it's so huge for him, uh, for every striker. And when the season starts, uh, that you want to be on that scoring list. So now he has his first. I'm sure there will come more. And as you mentioned, Lit also got his first Manchester United goal today. After the international break he had, how important was it for him to have a good game today? Oh, that is, yeah, it's a routine. We always have to play well. And, and when you come back to your club, you have to pick it up. Uh, we know uh, we signed a very good player with a lot of attributes. And one of them is he's a threat on set plays. And yeah, happy um, that he scored that goal. Very good cross, I think, from Bruno. So yeah, well done. I'm going in at the half-time break, 2-0 up. Was the instruction for you going into the second half to just control the game, or was it to go out there and kill the game off? No, kill the game off, and I think we had the chances. I don't know how many chances we had, but I think we had several chances to go early on to 3 or 4 now. I'm sure as a manager you could do without any serious injuries in the team, but Diogo Dallo appeared to be the only defender that started the game that didn't look like he came off with any kind of injury. Is that something for you to worry about now? Well, we had so international, short in the season, some are short in the pre-season, uh, some come from intercontinental flights. So, yeah, then you know, you and you, and you have a 12-30 game and that you can struggle uh, into the end, but yeah, hopefully it's nothing serious and yeah, we have to assess it today, tomorrow, and then we will see. Three competitions in the next three games for Manchester United. A result like this can certainly ease the pressure for now, but do you need to put a run of results together to really change the mood at Manchester United? No, the mood is very good eh, in our team. And yeah, we know always the expectations are so high, but you know, we have to deal with it. And you know, we have to build our season, and we will see in May. Eh, that was last season, nothing else. We will see in May eh, what's coming out. And we saw a first glimpse of Manuel Agate today, which I'm sure a lot of Manchester United fans have been waiting for. What can he bring to this team going forward? Yeah, it's good that we could bring him. And you saw straight what he brings to the team. He brings some control in the midfield, good interceptions. Uh, he can be very aggressive, but also on the ball, very composed, uh, keeping the game going uh, to linking to the uh, back and forward. So, yeah, I think first impression was very good. Thanks, Eric. Well done. You're welcome. Yeah, the mood is good. Eric Ten Hag said that goal for Marcus Rashford was huge. Before the game, Peter, you said a confident Marcus Rashford starts for England. What will that do for his confidence? Yeah, I, listen, he's not there yet. What's up guys, I'm back here with another video, please like, subscribe and share.